Hey everybody, what's happening? Uh, my name is Doug and I'm here to talk to you again about a new 5950 collection. Uh, as I record this, we are on the eve of the NBA playoffs and opening day is behind us, so the baseball season is underway. And I wanted to talk about this cap collection because it combines a couple of things that I really like. Um, number one is baseball cap design, um, which one of the things I love about that is a single alpha character or characters, um, kind of solitary and a minimal design on the cap. And one of the things they've done with this collection is really harness the logo design from NBA teams and turn that into more of an iconic baseball look um, by applying a single character in almost every case for each NBA team. So this Rockets cap I have in my hand, love it. Um, I'm really excited about this collection, but this one in particular because it's got the single R from the jersey, not quite as stylized as their full logo. Um, but we'll take a look at the rest of the collection and show you how New Era has taken the alpha characters, usually the lead character in the team's name, and just simply applied it to the cap. So take a look. All right, uh, taking a quick spin through the collection, uh, you can see here in almost every case uh, there is a single alpha character. Um, mostly in the cases that I've found is just simply lifted from the team's jersey, so it's often the first letter in the jersey uh, on a common jersey. And uh, you can really see that that um, ends up in a pretty nice, clean, minimal design, and some of these can be quite iconic. Um, Probably from the finals matchups of the past few years, the Warriors and Cavs, uh, pretty recognizable. Rockets is pretty iconic. Uh, Bulls has certainly got some uh, recognition there from that radial logo over the numbers, um, worn all those years by Jordan and, and others. And uh, some maybe not so familiar, lack of uh, playoff exposure or things like that, but certainly there's every team represented here. And I think it's uh, really a pretty cool collection for what they've done. And uh, like I said, I, I think it's really nice because it kind of fits the aesthetic of a baseball cap really well. So that's kind of a rundown. You can see some of these get a little um, uh, interesting with the Atlanta Hawks color choice there. Uh, L.A., of course, doesn't have a single character, but the L.A. from one of their jerseys. And uh, one other quick tip while I'm here is that I sometimes, when I'm looking at a particular cap and I've stumbled into... Uh, a team that I'm looking for and maybe find a new collection. Um, one of the things at lids.com that's kind of nice, and this is what I'm using to show you these caps, is if you go down to product details and just find this little link here at the very bottom that says view all products of this particular collection, if you click on that it's it's a nice automatic filter and then you can you know filter what sizes they still have available to check and see if they've got your team in your size so again I'm not affiliated with lids but I use that all the time because there's so many hats available um, on their site that I often get a little lost or overwhelmed and don't like to go into teams but I rather look at collections like this so that's kind of a nice thing you can do um, just to find more caps that you're looking for All right, uh, just a quick tour of the details on this Rockets cap. Again, I mentioned the character up front, and this one actually does a really nice job of kind of having a shadowed uh, combination of embroidery. You've got the white up front, but there's a little bit of uh, silver echo of the logo, kind of a silver shadow to this R. So that's a pretty nice detail. When you flip around to the back, you've got the standard uh, NBA uh, Jerry West logo. And uh, on this Rockets cap, it's in black and white. I'm not sure if that extends to all the caps in the collection, but uh, you can check that out for yourself. When you flip to the inside, you can see we've got the standard uh, or um, standard for um, exterior collections. You got the gray under visor, black seam tape with the branded logo. And then um, in contrast to some of the newer caps that New Era has been doing, they do not print on this new collection the labels on the inside, but these are actually stitched tabs. So you do get a little bit of a signal of what team it is over here. So this one's got the Rockets logo next to an NBA tab, and then your standard size tab and new era, manufacturer, location, etc. So uh, that's kind of a spin around the cap. I did notice that the Rockets uh, color on this cap is a little bit brighter than usual. I've noticed some of that with some of these caps. 
The other thing to note is I believe this um, rocket's cap happens to be 100% um, poly, probably the new wool material. But I did notice there's some interesting combinations of uh, wool, acrylic, and polyester throughout this collection. So some of them have a slightly different color, a uh, slightly faded color or look. Um, this rocket's cap is fairly bright, and I'm pretty sure this is a polyester cap. But um, anyways, you can check out uh, teams that you're interested in if you want to find out more details on that. So there you go. Final thoughts on this collection. Um, I think they did a really nice job. I mentioned that uh, with the minimal design on these caps. I actually like this series a little bit better than the NBA City series that had the alternate uh, designs and logos just because it's closer to a baseball aesthetic. And for that, with a baseball cap, um, I'm really happy to see a lot of these caps there. Even if they might not have the same familiarity um, when you wear one of these, uh, it might not be immediately recognizable as an NBA team. But overall, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's a different design direction, and I think it, uh, it's just a nice collection. I may pick up, pick up a couple more of these for a couple of other teams that look interesting. So anyways, uh, hope you enjoy the review. Check it out if you like, and uh, as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.